Is this thing on? I think so. Hey, yo, what up? Time to do our last eBay break of the night. 2017-18 Donner's Basketball number 39. Five boxes. Let's knock this out. Twenty-four packs per box. Oh God, that's a lot of packs. Put this away. I just, I just I wish they would just use less packs and put more cards in the packs like for real So many base cards in this. Most entertaining part of my day. Open packs. Honestly, I have I have no idea, Ninja. I have no clue. However, one of my boys actually does break Pokemon cards. 
PokemonBreaks.com, I believe, is his website if you want to check it out. He does stream on Twitch uh, every day except Friday and Saturday. So if you want to check out some Pokemon Breaks, I mean, I don't know if there's any money in it, to be honest with you. But you, you're more than welcome to check out his website and check out uh, his Twitch stream so you can see what they do. And if you're into it, you know, add to the family. You know, I, I used to collect the Pokemon cards when they first came out. And as far as I know, the only ones that are real, really worth money are the original, like Pokemon. But again, what do I know? I don't. I'm just talking out of my ass right now. Yo, Mario! Yeah. I, got a, I got a potential customer here. Wants to know if there's any money in Pokemon card breaks. Well, they're fun, Ninja, but they're not really, uh, it's not lucrative as far as money is concerned. I asked him, is there any money in card breaks for Pokemon? And he flat out said no. <laughs> and that's honesty, baby. That's what we do around here. of the card there apparently they didn't cut all the way through no worries ninja but yeah like I was saying I used to collect it when I was little and had I kept those, like, I was I was watching some video or whatever, like, what some of those Pokemon cards sell for. And some of those first edition, like, first box set cards sell for some pretty ridiculous money. You know, I was watching the video and I was like, at first I started crying. And I got really, you know, I went through the, all the stages of grief or whatever. Because some of the biggest cards that they were selling, I had like at least half of them. All first edition. They were in decent condition in my opinion. I mean, what do I know, of course. But yeah, I was thinking, I was like, man, if I had kept any of those cards, I would have some, well, some pretty decent chump change in my pocket. But I ended up giving it away to one of my friends at the time. So I hope he's happy. He might be like... Wealthy. Based. Man, I had a bra. I had, I had a bunch. Exactly. And that's just the tip of the iceberg, man. Like there's like there's certain cards that only come out like 
for example, in like tournaments and stuff, because you know it is a card game, so it's a game that you can play with other people, believe it or not. And there's certain cards that they that they release, and they give only to the winners of these tournaments and stuff. Like some of those cards sell for stupid money. Yeah, when, po when Pokemon first came out, dude, I was in, like, the first or second grade. So, that is, you know, my childhood for sure. So many packs, jeez. This is only, and this is only a quarter of a case, five boxes. Imagine doing a half case of this, oh my god. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure they have a print run, but they don't, we'll see. I don't know, man, Mario's the guy to, that, that really knows that. But yeah, I mean, they don't really have, yeah, they don't have like 101s or like relics. <laughs> But I'm sure they have like print runs where, you know, there's only but so many of that card, you know. But again, I don't, I don't, I'm just talking on my ass right now. One more box worth of packs to open. Ninja, let me ask you, man. Are there are there any like specific sports that you're into? Because we we are looking to get more product in store, and uh, of course we would love the opinion of our customers. Because at the end of the day, this is for you guys. So what, what sports are you into? What products would you like to see? Not just on eBay, but, you know, on our website as well. Gotcha, sports. Gotcha. Any any products in specific you would like for us to have, or you know what I mean? Alrighty, let's see what we got here. Patch for J. Ru Holiday Pelicans. Hard to get a hit in this stuff. Terrence Ferguson to two ninety nine Thunder.
this set would be so much better if it didn't have all that base. We do get in tea. We do, you know we we can get uh, high end products. Uh, that's why I'm asking. Like, what would you like to see? What what products? What sports? You know, so we can uh, make some moves and get it. We have a Chris Middleton to one eighty nine for the books. This is probably the autumn. Number to forty, Will Barton of the Nuggets. Nuggets getting a hit. Could have been disastrous. All right, dude. I'll see you later. Later, man. Be safe. Yeah. All by myself. Don't want to be all by myself anymore. Terrence Ross to 189 Magic. Doom, doom, doom. Doom, doom, doom. Damn, Booker to 49 Suns. One box down. Kyle Lowry of the Raptors to 199. Clippers, Blake Griffin with a patch. Steven Adams, the 99 Thunder. Was the second auto? There it is. Going to the Knicks, Mel Davis, old school auto right there for the Knicks. Real nice. Turner Pacers to two ninety nine. Kawhi Leonard of the Spurs to two ninety nine.
Jordan Bell, Warriors to 299. Patch for the Suns, Vince Carter. Curry Mavericks to Man, where's the third auto? Hiding right now. Hiding. For the Bulls, Robin Lopez, the autograph. Bulls getting a hit. Welcome to Lady Hawks to ninety nine. Gomez next to 49. Two boxes left. Denzel Valentine patch for the Bulls. Tim Hardaway Jr. to 199 Knicks. Evan Turner to 299 Blazers. Joe Johnson to 189 Jazz. Ralph Sampson auto numbered 8 out of 10 for the Rockets. Nice, clean-looking card. Dominators are always so nice.
Got a Jeremy Lin to 49 for the Nets. Alrighty. Last box mojo. What do we got? For the Pacers, David West patch. Wesley Evil do Magic, 1099. Bradley Beal to 29 Wizards. Still need to get one more auto. It's got to be in here somewhere. Jonas Valanciunas. There it is for the Raptors. Number to 40. The autograph. And that should do it for the break. Let's see if we can get uh, some more parallels or here. Kevin Durant to one eighty nine Warriors. Dang, it's almost 3.30? Wow. So Darius Thornwell of the Clippers, that's just a base card, so I don't know why they put that backwards. It's usually a variation or a short print or a numbered card or an auto or something like that. And the last stack here. We have Darren Collins of the 299 Pacers. And that, my friends, is going to do it for the break. So, let's go ahead and recap this. Autos only, you know how we do. We got uh, Jonas Valanciunas, 25 out of 40 for the Raptors. Ralph Sampson, 8 out of 10 for the Rockets. Uh, Robin Lopez, base auto for the Bulls. A male, uh, Mel Davis, base auto for the Knicks. And numbered 8 out of 40, Will Barton. Auto for the Nuggets. And that was the break. 2017-18. Donner's Basketball. Five box number 39. Thank you, eBay. We'll get that out to you.